Note that both the first two hitters been hit the ball to the opposite field. The off-speed pitcher, they're going to try to lay back and look for that pitch and go the other way because you know how he tied him up the last time he faced him. So Buckner with the right side of the infield open. Hernandez on the bag, guarding with Boggs. The outfield is just about straight away. Dykstra come back over more towards straight away than he was playing Marty Barrett. Surprised he's not shading him towards left center field. Boy, this crowd came here to make some noise tonight. Bowen. And that's one of the many reasons an unexpected guest at Shea Stadium. He could pull would be the three-one pitch, but with Ojeda, his big strength is changing speeds. He throw you, he'll throw you something besides the fastball when he's behind. Three and one. We'll watch Bob's. He's holding, and it's fouled away. Three and two. So they didn't play run and hit on that one. We'll see what they do this time. Remember Buckner with the bad legs is a definite double play possibility second in the major leagues in grounding into double plays so we'll see if that means that McNamara will turn Boggs loose I don't think he would because Buck doesn't strike out that much and he's got to stay away from a double play to get Rice up there in game one they didn't have the runner going and Buckner hit into the double play in the first inning Boggs is not going then goes late and the ball is hit to straightaway center to Dykstra Two out in the first inning, Wade Bob. 